I'm Rob with the Doctor's Toy Store. We're going to get down to business here. Um, stem cells. Everyone says, hey, these are these these survive. These are better. Ours is better. I've got brine shrimp. I hope there's no brine shrimp lovers because there may, may, may be some deaths involved. But I've got uh, a few hundred thousand, not hundred thousand, let's say, I, I couldn't even count. They're all live brine shrimp. Larger than stem cells, of course, but they're live brine shrimp. So we're going to have a little test here. We're going to run the Pure Sculpt. And the Vibrasat, the Vibrasat is like the micro -air. the Pure Sculpt's like the Power X. Uh, we're going to run one and see, see what happens to the stem cells. Okay, is everybody ready? Okay. Yeah. Here we are. We've got brine shrimp. I've got the Mandela. I've got two three millimeter equivalent cannulas, okay? And what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to go right in the brine shrimp. There we go. And I'm going to go ahead and turn this on. And we're gonna fill up, filling up right now, wow, right there. That's it, okay? So we just filled up and we're, we're done with that one. Now we're gonna run one on the Pure Sculpt. I honestly, I, I, uh, do you see anything swimming? Mm -mm. Nope. Listen, I hate to say it. Wait a minute. I think there's a live one. You definitely can't. Wow. There's a handicapped one. A couple of single survivors. Oh, uh, I don't see a, I see some without an arm or a leg. Yeah, there's one swimming. Oh, Lord. Looks like we got a, um, these right here. Our, we're live brine shrimp. Now, I don't see, maybe they have concussions. I don't know, they're not doing too well. How would those, there's one swimming right there. There's a survivor. So if you're doing fat transfers, I mean, let's try the, the pure sculpt, which turns right and left next, okay? So here's the brine shrimp. We're gonna try the pure sculpt, three millimeter cannula. Um, same suction, same level, here we go. This is rotational, back and forth, not a in and out jackhammer. Here we go. Perforated the bag, and we're at work. We're going, we're moving. Filling up. Okay, there are, there are, they're stunned, but I can see a lot more actually swimming. Let me bring the light down here. There's a lot more that are swimming. Okay, so let's see. Okay, I would say in this one, we've got a lot of action. Looks like there's a few deaths too, but this one has a lot more action. What we're gonna do is we're gonna take both of the results, we're gonna put them in a cup side by side so you can see. Maybe a few of them got stunned because they're going through that cannula at a pretty high rate. But it, it appears that this one, you know, let's put it this way. When you're going, when you're going so many RPMs in and out, you're gonna, you're gonna create a lot of damage. This one, obviously, you have more live. We're gonna put them in a containers and we're gonna see next to neck, each one by themselves, you can see which one is gonna have more live stem cells. You be the judge. Okay, everybody out there, look, here's what we got. These are the brine shrimp. This is the pure sculpt. Results, here are your results with your Vibrasat, Anything that goes in and out like a jackhammer, think about it. The faster you go, how are these little, little animals, stem cells, supposed to last when you're doing so many RPMs? You don't need to. It's a myth. This is our study. Do your own. Pure scope, pure sculpt, rotational. 
Vibra side. Bottom line is you want viable stem cells. Okay, you don't need to use all that speed. If you're not going to use the fat, by all means, turn it up and blast away. As far as stem cells, you better pick up a pure sculpt because you're not gonna have the results you want. Call the doctor's toy store today. 877 DRS Toys and um, all the brine shrimp. Um, let's have a big hand for, for the brine shrimp. Yay. Yay, they did a good job, even though some of them gave up their lives. Okay. Reporting for the doctor's toy store, Rob Raymond. Okay, here's another thing. Here we have the um, Bobber Sack, and here's the Pure Sculpt. Okay. One of the biggest complaints I get is this hand piece is so big, it's so heavy. It, it's so heavy. Look at the size of it. A lot of people can't even hold it correctly. This one. Look at the size. I mean, this is King Kong. Here you got something small for your hand. Now, here's something else important that can happen with any hand piece. It just will. You're doing liposuction. The hand piece stops. What do you do? Oh my God. The hand piece stops. So this one, you're going to have to stop and you really, you can't, you can't reconnect anything here. So you're going to have to go get a whole nother setup with everything to start again. Hand piece is bad. This hand piece stops. What happens? Manual, right here. All you do, take, switch right over here, put the suction in here, and you can keep going. Okay, you can keep going. Why? Because it's not proprietary. Watch this. So let's say this one stops, right? Just pop this off, take the cannula, cannula pops right out, and look, we got backup for you. We didn't forget about you. Made in America, and guess what? It's made better. Screws right on. Suction. Keep going. Oh, another huge difference. Come look at these cannulas. Come look, zoom in. All stainless steel. All stainless. It's not gonna break or snap. These guys snap and break, and they're an arm and leg from Germany. These made in America, you're gonna save your stem, save your stem cells, and you're gonna have a lot more usage. These are made to break, and they're very expensive. They will break. There's your difference. Which one do you wanna use? It's a huge myth. Everyone thinks that jackhammer effect is the golden rule, the golden way. But at the end of this video, we're going to show you the difference between a jackhammer and a drill. If you're going to go through a piece of wood, you can use a jackhammer or a drill. Concrete, jackhammer or drill. The jackhammer effect does a lot of damage. These are simple studies we do here at the doctor's toy store. Come, well, we'll do them here with you in front of us. If you want the best system, not the biggest and most expensive, called the Doctor's Toy Store for a more effective power-assisted LiPo. 877-DRS-TOYS. All right, so we went outside. I'm gonna show you the difference between the, the rotation and then the in and the out, okay? And the whole thing here is a lot of you have been taught through the years that the, the in and out, the micro air type is gonna be the best, the Vibrasap, but it's not true. You're killing a lot of stem cells. And if, if someone tells you the same thing over and over, you're gonna believe it, right? So I have some, some drills here. This represents the Vibrasat, Piker, Pure Sculpt, and Power X. We've got a piece of wood here, okay? And, and this one's larger, I couldn't find another one. Basically, this one goes in and out. So let's go ahead down here for a second. And this is what you're doing when you use a, a Micro Air Vibrasat. That's 
huge myth that the rotating doesn't go through. But if you think about it, you go to a dentist. Does a dentist use the jackhammer effect on your teeth? Or does he use the rotation? The rotation cuts through the fat just as well, if not better, than the in and the out. The in and the out are killing stem cells, murdering stem cells, those poor stem cells. If you're taking stem cells out and you're re-putting them back in the body, you're, you're killing a lot of stem cells and uh, the better choice would be the rotation. Not only that, it doesn't give you the jackhammer on the arm, the, the wrist, the arm and shoulder. A lot of doctors get a lot of problems after using those for a while. It's a jackhammer effect. Doctor's Toy Store 877 DRS Toys. Please subscribe to our channel. Real news for real doctors.